Isma Olaxis has been granted a 10 million non-cash bail today in court and asked to return on the 15th of October this year. Now, if you have not been following this story, kindly stick around till the end of this video. And if you're new here, kindly subscribe, click the bell button, give this video a thumbs up and also drop a comment down below. For the returning subscribers, love for you guys always. Now, let's get into Mr. Olaxis real quick. Now, we all know this guy for doing, you know, his uh, Facebook live thing like he comes on facebook and does his thing he usually you know has a lot to say about different things that are happening around celebrities lives yes i'm not going to say he gives opinions he attacks yeah he attacks he usually attacks and if you're a celebrity by the way i, I am i was actually thinking if i were a celebrity i would cry too because this guy a sabuda that's all i can say now this time he attacked the wrong person now this whole thing started when mr suna omulangila suna we all know him he's a ugandan musician and very talented by the way went ahead and you know posted a house and you know had things to say about it and said if you before you reach a, a certain age that is 40 years there are some things you should have as a man like a house you know something of your own something you should be proud of and of course you know we have tv personalities uh, that is case wako and mako uh hosted isma all access to discuss this particular you know post and they had a lot to say they were like why would you even show off yet we know you love older women and that's why you get all your money from your parents died like you even use black magic so who are you to come and you know show off and tell us people have things uh, you know they had a lot to say and uh they went ahead and said even if you held a concert right now you know your entry fee would be two thousand ugandan shillings and below nothing more than that and you know oh Mulangila Suna was not so happy about it he went or he called a press conference and you know complained he even cried poor man he cried so much and said my babies watch tv and they they see you know saying all this trash about daddy i still have both my parents so where do you get these things that you say about me you know what guys i'm a sue y'all i'm going to sue all of you and yes i'm taking you to court and yes he went ahead and took them to court he went ahead and you know, accused them of offensive you know communication and uh, trash talking him and the police did what it had to do he, they arrested case wako and mako these guys work on a certain you know local television in uganda and they were arrested on friday that is first of october now during that time isma was nowhere to be seen and he actually you know came on live and said what are you saying if you see my our drone run for your life i am the president of the uganda bloggers association what are you going to do to me don't you know i have immunity like i'm not scared of you i have i can buy lawyers like i have we, we have the best lawyers that money can buy there's nothing that you 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 have on us like i mean you 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 uh omlangila so not, nothing i'm not even scared of you omlangila had to clap back and said you're not scared of me well there's a whole one million shilling bounty on you if i get you you're going to prison in fact if anyone gets you they should take you directly to prison and yes whoever showed them that where this guy was kudos to you they got him and arrested him on sunday now he he stayed there he, as he tried to ask for bail but no the judge refused and said they should come back the following day yeah so today he was given bail uh yeah thanks to god but you know this thing had you know uh um, social media divided saying who went too far is it omlangila suna is it isma all access but after being arrested he actually had something to say he was like all bloggers out there learn from me let's stop doing this thing let's not get paid you know cartoon money to trash talk people like it is so bad you know learn from me but he didn't of course say about you know his experience in prison he was like you should learn a, a lot about me and i am a law-abiding citizen and i agree with the judge but still i plead not guilty now hit me up in the comment section and tell me what you think about isma olaxis and also let us discuss who do you think went far is it isma olaxis uh the other present uh is it the other presenters sorry or is it omlangila suna thank you for watching bye